am a gay Christian, and the time that I felt most filled with the Holy Spirit was when I kissed a woman. Can you link that food back to the Bible? If you're going to hold the Bible above my personal relationship with Jesus Christ, then you have held the Bible as an idol. A lot of people don't know this, but on Friday, my daughter, she's four years old, she had her third epilepsy seizure attack. It was worse, her worst seizure. For 30 minutes, she seized paramedics. They came. I got behind them driving, got to the hospital, and my wife told me that my daughter stopped breathing in the car twice. So I'm, of course, praying. We get to the hospital. They put, give her a bunch of medicine. That she sees the stop. She's laying there. And at this point, if she seized for 30 minutes, you start to fear there could be development issues that could mess with her brain or worse. So we prayed and we prayed, and she had medicine, and my wife and I had to stay overnight at the hospital. In the middle of the night, probably about three o'clock, I heard a knock. And the knock, the knock was my daughter. I prayed for her. I said, God, let this just be an attack from the enemy and let him have overplayed his hand and my daughter come back stronger than before. When I heard my daughter talk in the middle of the night, she woke up talking clearer than she was talking before. Now, anyone who deals with epilepsy knows it takes a little a few days for them to come back. She was talking clearer than before. The next morning when she got up, my daughter was so sharp. We get to play this game and it's great. But when we get to lead this game, we go back to being regular people. And regular people are living life and people are waiting for a knock. And the word says who Jesus is, he's knocking at the door. All you got to do is get up.